Hello and welcome to the very first video on Dax's Diecast Studio. So I changed the name to dedicate to my son because he absolutely loves cars. And while he's only two and a half years old, he actually knows a lot about cars already, but most importantly, he can't drive them. So the only way that he can really enjoy cars right now is with these little diecast cars. So I thought it would be fun to start a channel for him just to show you guys the collection we have and the different tracks that we're gonna put them on um, and basically our journey with them. I'm just gonna open up the camera. So just to start an intro, I guess, I built him this tire contraption with the shelving and the LED lights. And he absolutely loves this, this contraption here. Um, he's always taking cars off, putting cars on. Most of our cars are um, legit make and models, Hot Wheels. Some are Matchbox, uh, very few. And some are just uh, very, very few are dollar store cars like this one here. See, I think it's the only one I can find right now. And these are just relatives buying him cars because they know that he, he really enjoys them. So there is the wheel. I will go through the collection for you guys. I'm not going to name every single one, but I'll name them as I know them. So we got an AMG. I think this is AMG CL45. Uh, Porsche 911. This is a Matchbox car, Lamborghini um, SUV. I can't remember the name of that one. Uh, Toyota Supra, cartoony one. Another Hot Wheels car. I think it's a Chev something. Um, this is a another Hot Wheels car. Let's see what this one is. Track Manga, and this one is a 57 Chevy. I, I had a feeling that's what that was. And just for fun, let's see what this one is. It's a Lamborghini LM, LM002, it says. I knew it was an LM, I just didn't want to get the numbers wrong. Buick Grand National, Ford GT40, another Hot Wheels, Hot Wheeler, Porsche 911, Aston Martin, this is a newer one, so I don't know it all that well. DB10. Uh, another Hot Wheel. This is a Leeway something. What's this one called? Maximum Leeway. And then we got a Volvo SUV. XC40. And we got a Hot Wheels race car, a Camaro, a Mustang, a Mustang SVO. Uh, a Gasser Corvette. Um, this one, I believe, is a McLaren Speedtail. A BMW. There's a dollar store car right there. That's the one that I was thinking of. Uh, I think that one's a Lotus. A Toyota Hilux. Maximum leeway. A Hot Wheel car that actually came with one of the tracks that we have for him. A Ford Escort. A Mitsubishi, Mitsubishi Pajero Evolution. A Hummer. Uh, electric Hummer, a speed sign, which I thought was pretty cool. That is a matchbox. And then we got a orange C6 Corvette. And then we got a Mazda AutoZam Mitsubishi Eclipse, a Porsche 911, S2000, SRT8 Challenger. This is another Hot Wheel special. Which one is this one, guys? Mod Speeder. And then we got a Chev truck. Um, that came in one of the kits, ZL1 Camaro and this Hot Wheel hauler. And then over here we have the Mario Kart guys because we have the Mario Kart track. We have a Ram Rebel here and it's kind of weird that these decals come off quite easily and I thought Hot Wheels would be a little bit better than that um, paint wise. But this is an HKS Ranger, it's coming off pretty easy. This is a passing gasser. <laughs> it's kind of a funny name. Uh, this one we just bought him, or uh, Punk Rod. So we usually like to have normal make and model, um, although he does. He's a kid and he enjoys what he enjoys. These are the larger ones here. Uh, got a Ford F one fifty Raptor, an Aston Martin. I can't remember what this one is. Uh, Vulcan, duh. Port or. Uh, uh super mark 5 and a lexus is 300 and then we got a zl1 here uh this is a new one that's uh 
what Hammond crashed in a Rimac with a Jaguar beneath it, Honda Civic, a Ford, Focus RS, a Hummer H1. This is another one that came in the pack. So these green wheels, I believe, are supposed to be ones for better suited on the track. Fast gas. Um, and then he's got a little mini truck here. Japan mini truck. I don't know which one this is. There's so many. Let's just call it a Mighty K. And Dodge Viper. Uh, Mustang mach -E. And this little guy here. I don't know what they call this one. But um, he has more than this. I just can't find them. And they're probably lost in our vehicles somewhere. So that's the intro. Short intro to what he has on display right now. There's probably give or take 10 more scattered throughout our vehicles and the house. So I'm gonna go show you what we have for tracks right now. So this is our tracks right now. We gotta clean this space up and make it uh, more track orientated. Um, but right now we just have the, I'll put the screenshot up of this, what this one is. I think it's like fire stunt something. Uh, we just bought it for him. I'm gonna use this Porsche cause it goes pretty good. Some of the cars do not work with this very well whatsoever. I had to take this flame out because some of the cars would just launch into the flame. Um, but the Porsche does not. It does a fairly good job. And it's nifty. It comes with this little box that you can integrate into the track and store all of your uh, all of your stuff. So instead of putting up the thing, there it is, track builder. Oh, it doesn't tell you which one it is. But you can see there's literally so many variations of what you can do with this thing. So it's too bad it doesn't say the name on the front. Um, but very cool. And then this of course is the, uh, this is the uh, Mario Kart one. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, this one, see, each car is different. Some of them do better. Oh, come on, Porsche. Come on. Some of them do better than others on different tracks. Uh, so it's weird that that one didn't go through, but you know, it goes through and then all the way back. So that's cool. I'll go downstairs and show you guys what we just I wasn't lying when I said we just got it. We literally just got it. And I've been waiting for this for quite some time. Um, I can't remember what the regular price is on this. I think it's around 300 bucks. I could be wrong. I'll, either way, I'll put a screenshot on. I did buy it on sale and it was $180 Canadian uh, shipped to the door. So this one will be a fun one for sure. This is a, a drag race setup and I think my son will really enjoy it because it's, you know, simple operation, a one button and, and then all the cars race. So very excited to set that up for him. And last but not least, I guess I'll show you guys the collection we got going on. This is the first treasure hunt that I have found, if you could believe that. Um, but I have so many of them still in packages um, just because I'm a car guy. And when I see cool cars, um, I buy them, especially obviously Fast and Furious had a big, a big... Um, impact on me and parents owned a cyclone I've, it's kind of funny i've owned a supra an eclipse gsx the supra i've owned an evo 7 we've owned a gtr just not an r34 haven't owned an r35 yet i've owned a 350z and of course i haven't owned that truck but all of the cars are in there and then going on to the next side here, we got some other cool cars. There's a nice one, Mustang. A uh, Land Cruiser and the Enterprise. And then there's that, there's a C7 Vet and a Mazda 787B. On top of, you know, Dark Horse. And another Supra. And then here's an, some more collection in there. Got a Lightning, another Cyclone. Uh, Fox Body. Five liter. And yeah. So that's my collection. 
All right, everybody, I'm going to end it off here, I think. Um, I just wanted to give you guys a quick introduction to um, my son's current collection, a little bit of my collection, and some tracks we have. And, uh, you know, stick around for future videos that, uh, that'll include racing the cars on the tracks. Um, it'll be fun doing that drag, drag, sti drag strip style um, one. And when we get new cars or if we find them around the house or the vehicles. Because I know that we have a Mark V Supra somewhere floating around. Not this one, but a Hot Wheel one that came in a pack. And I just seen it not too long ago. But anyways, that's all I have for you guys today. Um, please give the video a thumbs up if you like what you see. And subscri subscribe if you um, want to see more content like this in the future. Um, uh, playing around with some Hot Wheels or Matchbox or whatever it may be. Um, Alright, I'm going to end off the video here. Thanks everybody. Till next time.